I just hate hiding all the time. Yeah. Feeling like everybody's whispering about me. Oh. Being afraid people are gonna find out I'm this freak. Sometimes I just want to be normal. Lena, you're a miracle. Why would you ever want to be normal? I remember reading the first five pages and knowing that I wanted to do it. This man is a god. From the first time that I met Richard, he had a real specific take on this material. We were impressed with Richard from the very beginning. He took the magic of our world so seriously. I said to Kimmy, this is the guy. Action. I love mythologies. The book has wonderful ideas in it and, and great characters and a great story. The script made me want to do the movie because it was just very well developed. The teens that we were writing for wanted to hear not only a boy's voice, but they wanted the girl to be the powerful supernatural and the boy to be the mortal. Our family's different. We have powers. I've always loved supernatural stories, fantasy stories, because I think that they're actually a great way of talking about reality. What first caught my eye was it was set in a southern gothic world. It was so beautiful, but also a little creepy and everything that goes with that. May as well show yourself. I know you're out there. And this idea of the supernatural world hiding under this small little town. This must run under the whole town. The whole country. What is surprising is nobody is who they appear to be. Why didn't you tell us about this? A keeper has to be asked. I like the idea that it was a love story told from the point of view of a young man falling in love with a girl as opposed to the other way around. I think that the thing that makes the male perspective different is that you get to see me courting her and where I come from. You don't know anything about me. This was a different one because it's a big book. And when you adapt that, there are certain ideas that I felt I could not translate to film. And so I had to focus on what would really move the story along in a film. And for me, it was the love story. Between now and my birthday, I just want to be with you. <laughs> All the characters, they work together as puzzle pieces and make this great movie. It took me a while to streamline the rules, the different kinds of casters and powers that there are. Even though he has made changes, he's been able to kind of capture the heart of not only the town and the story, but each character. And he found actors that could embody those characters. Jeremy Irons was actually Cammy's idea of Macon when she was writing the book. He brought to Macon something that I, I hadn't even thought of. He was more human, is Macon. You have to control your emotions. Loving this boy puts you in terrible danger. The script, and I think the film, will become like an extension of our universe. The level of detail that's been taken in translating yeah. our world from the page to the screen is phenomenal. We walked onto the set with Richard, and it felt like stepping into our book. I think we almost started to cry. I mean, it was so spot on. Lena will not turn dark. She's too strong. To see Allison Alden, Jeremy Irons, Viola Davis, and Emma Thompson saying lines from the script and the book feels like the book is alive. My powers will be claimed for either the light or the dark. You see the way she looks at the boy? There's no getting in between them now. It has begun. Thank you.